Okay, so we are back to fiddling about with the Youngmeister and as you can see it's progressed quite a lot but it's getting to that stage now where I have to add some surface detail to make the model look a little bit more authentic without going overboard it's not a perfect scale model after all. One of the areas I need to address is this. These screws are obviously required to lock the struts in place for the upper wing. But on the prototype there is some form of cover on the different Junkmeisters that I've observed and I intend on trying to make them by forming a mould. So this is what I'm going to actually do. I've roughly marked out a mould in balsa and tend to use this to press through after heating some plastic cord and hopefully forming a plastic mould which will cover the offending screws. So let's see how that goes. So having made the mould the next stage is to produce a female part that the mould will press through and I know from experience, having played around with this idea before, that the, the hole that you actually make needs to be at least the thickness of the card that you're going to push through and a little bit. So on this scrap piece of ply, this is going to be removed. The plastic card will be stapled onto here, heated up with a heat gun, and then I'll push the mould through. Let's see how we get on. Okay, so there we go. Hole cut in the plywood. You can see I made it too big the first attempt. Hole cut in the plywood. The male plug with something to hold on to. I've stapled some plastic card onto here, um, it's about one millimetre thick and now I'm going to apply some heat and we're going to see if it works. There's no guarantee it will but he who dares, let's see. it through not hot enough not hot enough it's starting to go there though let's see push it through there you go I think that will work No, it's distorted there. You can see there wasn't enough material you've got to allow for the the pull on it. So if I take that out, um, typical trick here, not having things to hand. If I cut that around. Coming out. Ah, well, you can see that that's obviously where it's it's gone too much. So, if I, but if I pull it out, you can see how that would work as a cover with this piece cut out. Let's just see what it looks like. Cut that out rough now I don't care because it's there you go so that would fit there right I think that was I think that's going to work I'll try again with a bigger piece it's more overhang and I think the one mil is about right so let's try that 
So let's try again this time. I've overlapped it a little bit more. Um, let's see how it goes. Well, that seems to. I'm going to try again and add a little bit more heat because I've. I think that might work, you know. Let's see if I cut that out. There you go. That should have a little bit of persuasion. I've gone right through. There you go. So with a little bit of trimming up, let's see if I can do that quickly. Always a danger of making a mess of it when I do this, but let's try. Not with that knife, I can't. Here we go. There you go. And that, I think that works. I might have to adjust it a little. But I think that will work as a technique. I think it needs to be a little bit more rounded on the top here to give it more room to go around the but yeah, that's going to work.